afternoon, guys. Good evening. It's 5 o'clock. Today's the 13th, Friday the 13th of October 2023. I'm in Darien, Connecticut. It's kind of like Stanford, Greenwich, a little more north. Um, I'm on call tonight. Have a call with a thermostat issue, supposedly. They always say it's a thermostat issue, but even if it needs uh, a TXV, they'll say it's a thermostat issue. But um, let's uh, see what it is. And then I think I have another call after this. 65 degrees, sunny, Friday. But I'll take the hours. Uh, that's it. It's going to rain tomorrow. Probably Sunday. It's like the 10th weekend in a row. And uh, that's it. Let's see what's going on. How are you? How you doing? Can I come in the front? Here's my card, just so you know who's here. Oh, yeah, I know. You're right. Thank you so much. Don't worry about the blue things. Two no, dogs. I'm I sure? Uh, yeah. It's respect. <laughs> you see? You know, no, no, no. No, your house is beautiful. No, no, no. Really, truly, we have okay, to okay. leave them there. Yeah. Right. That's fine. What's going on? So I'm messing up the setting the temperatures. I don't think you're messing it up. I, I think I am. That's my husband. Can't How are you? What's your name? Kevin. 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 Paul, how are you? What's your name there? Linda. Linda, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. How are you? Where's oh, the good. thermostat? It's up here. Okay. May I go up? Oh, yeah, of course. I'll, I'll go up. I gotta find my phone too and my eyeglasses. So. Okay. Um, because I have a picture of Kevin and I can set the. Um, Is this it right here? Yeah, that's it right there. Okay. So, um, so tell me what's happening. All right. So I think when somebody was here, he did set it with all, like times to go up. And a on schedule. Which, yeah. But I don't think I need the schedule. Okay. So the, the dogs are both very friendly, but they're better off outside. So I had it on heat mm -hmm. and I wanted it to hold at 67. It went up to 82. Okay. And then when I tried to make, make it go off, it would be off, but it wouldn't go down. So I put it on air conditioning. Brought the dropped. temperature down, and then from air conditioning, I could turn it off. Okay. So right now it's on cool. Yeah, let's put it to heat. All okay. right. I got it. Heat, and let's bring it up to 69. Okay. To see if it keeps running. Can you show me, what do you have, a boiler or heat pump? Heat pump. You have a heat pump. Can you show me the system? Oh, in the attic, you mean? Yes. Yeah, sure. Please. My daughter's up here. This is Claire. Dip switch issue, I know it is. All right, let me open this up and check the dip switches. Yeah, there they are right there. So we're looking for two ton and this one right here. So these are the, and here's my model serial. Let me open this up and check some dip switches because it says here, Auxiliary heat, yeah, your dip switches have to be in certain spots and I need to check the wiring on this too because it's got a wireless thermostat.
Should be in W2, I believe. Let me see. Okay, so the dip switch was up on number SW1, which will keep the system running at all times, unless it's a remote. And that's not a wire. That's not a remote. It's a wired thermostat. Container that we gave him. We're going to let that see if we turn off. Okay, I'll be right back. So I think the temperature downstairs is at 69, and I have it set for 75. Just bring it down to 65, please. Thank you. So the heat goes off when she brought it down to 65. Question is, is it going to... How long is the delay? And let me see. I have power still. Let me see if I still have a call. So now let me wait on delay to see how long that. No call. Okay. Let's see how long the delay is. This dip switch right here was set to off, but when you have a when you don't have the control, the OEM control, you need to set the dip switch to one here. So, let's see if it goes off in about 90 seconds. So I took this wire here and we put it into B8 right there. So this needs to be in B. This is a heat pump, not W. The reason why I put a double wire in there is because this, term, this Molex isn't holding it. But for now, let me do some testing. Um, then I'm going to have to go outside and make sure that it's wired into B there as well. Nope. Now bring it up to heat again. Thank you. So they had this wired into W. As you can see, it's WOB, but it's got to be wired into B down here. So now it'll kick on the. 74 is fine, dear. I appreciate that. I'll ask you when to turn it off in a couple of minutes. Let me just get my thermometer out so I can do a temp rise. 74. It's common in B. Let's check the temp rise. So it wasn't anything with the dish, dip switches. It was people not wiring things right. This is hot as nice. And we're coming up here at 95. And I'm actually off the trunk, so. Hey, miss, will you now go ahead and lower the heat, but don't turn it off. Just lower it down to 65. Thank you. So before when we got here, the fan wouldn't shut off, and it just kept overheating, overheating, overheating. So. Now the heat just went off, and we'll give it some time. See, the fan just shut down immediately. Thank you. I like to put them to work a little bit, but uh, I'll, I'll put the clip. The next clip will have this dropping down. Yeah, there you go. It's off, and let's see if we, when we climb, start to climb down, the system's off. So it just might take a minute. That's a train. <laughs> That's not the air handler. All right. So there you go. That's a wrap. So with these units, well, with any heat pump, 
you don't wire in the W. I don't, I don't understand it. I, when I got here, I thought that was an issue, but whatever. It is what it is. It's all good. And they have the wireless 6,000 downstairs. I still have to go to bed for New York now. I've got cookies. And no, no, no. I You're sweet. Water. No. Nothing? They don't make them like you anymore because oh. people don't <laughs> offer that. Right, baby? <laughs> He's Look at my you. good boy. He's adorable. He's a good kid. You're yeah. adorable. He's eight. Look how much gray fur he has. Nah, he looks young. Yeah. I kind of like it when he's a little mischief because that means he's still... This really filter. Good. Let's check this guy. Uh, Give it another month or two. And then what do I do? Just swap, swap it? it out. Oh, I put a new one in. These are throwaways. Yeah, let's see. This might be a 12 by... It looks like a 10 by 30. I don't know what this thing is. Okay, so just order those online. Watch yourself. I don't want to yeah. drop that on you. Uh, yeah, but I want to give you the size. I'm going to break it. <sighs> 10 by 30. Okay, it's a 10 by 30. And it's kind of it? an odd size. It's a pleated filter. Mervyn. Five years late on putting the, putting the one of the coasts this way. What's, oh. It's too, it's split. Yeah. Eight, um, where Walgreens is. And they were going to put an Amazon? No, they were going to print. They wanted to print a bigger super. Oh, you know, got you, got you. Yep. Family, so that was just a simple, well, took me a couple minutes, but it was a simple uh, people not realizing that when you have a heat pump, you're not throwing uh, the W wire in. But it is what it is. That's why you have reversing valves. Um, let's see what's next. I have another call. It's late. I like kind of filming when it's dark out. If the call means anything, you'll see the rest of it. All right, guys, I'll take you ride for the next, take you around for the next call. This says, um, no heat, hydronic heat not working. I think there's two systems at this house, according to my tablet. I've never been there, but I'm in Connecticut now. I'm driving to Bedford, New York. It says it's about 42 minutes, but that's bull because I can't go on parkways. Who knows? But let's see what it is when we get there. Um, yeah, let's check it out. And then I'm going home after this. I don't know. I'm not taking any more calls. I don't really care. It's true. It's not hot. It's not cold or hot out. Uh, I've been here. I, th I thought I wasn't, but I've been here. Hello, heating and air conditioning? Does your heat work? But I can't come in tonight? Okay, so we'll call you Monday. Okay. Wow. Absolutely bizarre. You go to a house because they call you on an emergency for no heat, and then you get there and the mother or the mother-in-law says you can't come in. Okay, but do you have heat? No. Okay, well, then you're gonna have to call us after hours and you're gonna pay for that. But I didn't get into all that, but that's what's gonna happen. I called the number on the file, the actual homeowner, and he said he had an emergency. But, I mean, why'd you just call an hour ago? I mean, that's... That's why I like to work in like Lower Westchester, which is towards like the Bronx, White Plains, the Bronx, because I don't know, you just have different type of people. Whatever. Hopefully the emergency is not too serious, but um, anyway, guys, have a great weekend. It's 7:18 on Friday night. Enjoy your weekend, even though, well, in New York State, it's going to rain again, as I said before.
But uh, thanks for watching. Take care. Have a good night.